if you have an original Apple Pencil that is not working, you can see not working. If you look at the Bluetooth settings, there, Apple Pencil, not connected. And you try to charge it. You can see that it doesn't even pull up as a device. Apple Pencil still not connected. If you go to the Bluetooth settings, you click on that, it says Apple Pencil not connected, plug in Apple Pencil to use with this iPad. You can see I've plugged it in, no sign. Even if it's not charged, it should be charging, right? Also, it doesn't show up on the widgets, as you can see. That's just my iPad. It's well charged, so it should be able to deliver a charge to the Apple Pencil, but it doesn't do it. I've left this for 24 hours, absolutely nothing. I found out why it's doing this. It's because the Apple Pencil is designed to work with a little bit of charge in it. So when you see your Apple Pencil charge down to zero, when it's low battery and it's down to zero, it's not really down to zero. It's got a little bit of charge left to do all the connections, syncing, and kick off a charge in, right? Now, unfortunately, sometimes you can leave your Apple Pencil completely unused, maybe for months, and then it charges down to absolute zero. The battery is completely flat. So the only way to get this going again is to somehow kickstart the charge in and the way you do this is really, really strange. And that's to raise the temperature of the Apple Pencil in a safe way for about 15 to 20 minutes. I've seen people using uh, a hot bag or something like a hot water bottle. Just place this pencil under a hot water bottle for 15 to 20 minutes and then connect it back to the iPad and that should kickstart the charging. Let's try it out. Unfortunately, I don't have a hot water bottle or a hot bag or anything. So when I made myself a cup of hot, hot coffee, I basically used the rest of the water, poured it in a pan. I mean, you can do this. You can, you can heat it up however you like. This is how I'm heating mine up. The whole point is to bring the temperature up safely to a certain amount. So I just basically poured the hot water in the pan. This is an aluminum pan, so it's conductive. So it's very, very hot. And I simply wrap the Apple Pencil safely in a rag, like so. So the Apple Pencil is in the rag. Place the rag down and place the pan on top of it. Okay, so now that should safely bring the temperature up to the required amount. I'm gonna leave that for 15 minutes while that heat gets transferred to the Apple Pencil in a safe way and have my cup of coffee. So now it's been sitting there for 20 minutes straight. That's still kind of warm, it's not as hot as before. That feels nice and warm to the hand. The pencil feels warm to the hand. So now I'm gonna plug it in. Boom. Apple Pencil, finally, connect, pair. How strange, huh? Now it's connected. Now I go to this, look, charging. Not, not only is it charging, it's lying to me that it's almost fully charged. That's complete and utter nonsense, <laughs> but it's charging. Hope that helps, if it helped, don't forget to subscribe. I'm trying to reach a thousand followers. Thank you very much. Bye.